Have I not commanded thee? Be strong and of a good courage. Be not afraid. Neither be thou dismayed with them. You're late again. 20 minutes this time. Really? Yeah. There's days you're always late. You practically turn up late for every prayer meeting. Oh, so like he's early. Is she referring to me? Listen here, listen. I basically leave the house two hours. You aren't the one she's referring to. Is it you? He has never been late. Oh, really? Huh? I see you're just defending him. You know he's never been late. So why has he decided to remain silent? Is it until she dies before he answers? Jess, you must realise that sometimes life doesn't always go the way you want. Also, oh, what's the point of praying, fasting, being an active church member? What's the point of doing that all when he won't come through when you need him the most? I just... Uh, yeah, say something. So why should I be late? Tell me. At least no one is hurt because I came late. But Emily is in the hospital battling a chronic disease and the doctors can't even help they said she only has a few days left and apparently the only one that can help her is silent i mean aren't we praying enough fasting enough tell me what haven't i done lord where are you I'm Jessica. Again, I'm sorry about Emily's condition. You don't have to be sorry. It's not about you. It's about him. I understand what you're going through. I lost my older brother two years ago to cancer. The grief, the pain, is unbearable. I almost lost faith. But he said to me, I am the resurrection and the life. He who believes in me, though he may die, he shall live. My brother, he believed and so he lives. Even through death, he lives. And I believe Jesus can save. I don't know what to say, but God is God. He's not human. And it says in 2 Peter chapter 3, verse 9, God is not slack concerning his promise, as some people count slackness, but he's long suffering towards us. I understand you think he's being late, but actually he would come in his own time. The Almighty dwells outside of time. He neither comes early or late. He comes in his own time, and his time is the best. Remember Lazarus? He was dead in the eyes of men, but to God he was just sleeping. The way we see the situation is different from how God sees it. Then, so what will happen to Emily? She believes in the Lord with all her heart and she serves him, so I believe she'll live. And how long will that take? I can't tell you how long it will take, but this is the confidence that we have in him, that if we ask anything according to his will, he will hear us. Let us pray again. I'm sure. You'll be there with me I'm sure Absolutely sure That in the fire furnace You'll be the fourth man there But even if you slay 
Just wait. 